and then it's subtracting 5,000 from 5,000. Oh, yeah, that's probably right. In the amount of years it goes by. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. So, so one year. Yeah. 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 So, yeah. So some of the stuff that I enjoy this year about math in particular is like I definitely like how we're focused more on the teamwork and how like I like how you're graded on the participation in the team test because so, that like benefits like we're all talking to each other and like creating like new ideas which I find at least very interesting. I also like the retests because it really means that like everyone's everyone's like learning, learning the material. It's not like, oh, I took that test and I got like a C and now like I'm done and I'm never gonna like think about that again. Like you keep learning each like, each like idea over and over again. And I really like that. I would say like those are the two main things. I like taking the retest because I feel like I can learn more um, by trying again because I, I just feel like I, <laughs> I, yeah, I just like taking the. Re I just like learning more from the the previous tests and take more information from that and sharpening my skills from the corrections. And I feel like I can learn more when I'm trying again. Okay. okay. The X, Y, a table, graph, rule, and words below each describe a different town. Based on the information you are given about each town's population, decide which town is growing the fastest. And explain how you know. So. Wait, what? Oh, number of people. Okay. It's oh, it's yeah. here. A is here, B is here. You should find a growth So it's like 8,000 in one year. No, because the years. No, 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 for a population of okay. So. So, uh, plus one year. Year. Ah, so the rule for town B. Town A equals. How much does it go by? By 4,500 equals 4,500 people. People. But every four years it goes by. Wait, what's 8 plus 2? Group work and math because it gives us a chance to think about what we're doing and if we don't understand it then we have our peers to tell us what is happening or it's a good way to think about what, well, it's a good way to see different ideas and to see different ways of thinking on the same problem because in math something we're working on is finding different methods for the same, to get the same answer and that's kind of hard to do with yourself when, um, so, I mean, I'm just stuck on one piece, one piece of information and that I might be missing, and group work can really help with that. What I also like is um, that correcting our math homework, it gives us like, um, it gives us like, you, if when you did, if you did the answer wrong, you could, um, you could correct it and now you have another way to do it, or now you, you've learned how to do it from the corrections.